All right, guys, what is up? Welcome back to yet another episode. And before we get things started, I just want to say sorry for the lack of content. School started back up and I actually just got a job, so I'm super busy. But in today's video, we're fishing the spillway using live bluegill and artificial lures to go after big tarpon and big snook. We're gonna be using my 4K Shimano Stratic with my St. Croix Moho intro rod. This is my heavy setup for big fish, and that is exactly what we're doing today. We're going after big fish. But I'm not going to talk too much. I'm just going to tell you all to stay tuned because this video is going to be epic. But yeah, like I said, let's just get straight into the video, man, and I'll see you guys on the water. Look at that tarpon, man. Let's go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Come on. You got it, buddy. Look at that tarpon, guys. Oh, yeah. There he goes. He's kicking. Make sure to got these fish really good. I think he's good. There he goes. Let's go. This is going to be the end of day one. Sorry if I'm a mess. I'm, I know I'm really sweaty, but yeah, this is going to be the end of day one. We're probably going to come back tomorrow with more live bluegill. See if we can get more tarpon, more snook, more whatever, man. But if you guys haven't already, smash that like button. And while you're at it, just smash the subscribe button, all right? So uh, we're going to roll the footage for the next day, and uh, let's get back to fishing. All right, guys, we are back at the spillway. It is day number two. And let me tell you, man, we got some good baits today. It's about four o'clock right now. School just got out. I went to this pond and loaded up on some bluegill. And the setup for today is exactly what we were using yesterday. My Shimano Stratic 4000 St. Croix Moho inshore rod with 50 pound leader and a one not Mutsu circle hook. So without further ado, I'm gonna quit talking and I'll see you guys when I get to the spillway. But yeah, like I said, these bluegill are perfect size. Look at that, perfect size. Go ahead and grab another one, perfect size. We're gonna get to fishing and hopefully stick a tarpon or a snook. live bluegill first pass it took like five seconds probably about solid 25 inch fish really healthy one we're gonna go ahead and release him not a bad fish at all he's ready I'm gonna send him his way there he goes Oh, 
just like you wanted. That is sick. Alright guys, second tarpon of this video. Probably about a five, five pounder. Ate the artificial UA terrorize. That is sick, man. We're gonna go ahead and snap a few pigs and release them. Alright guys, took some quick photos and got this nice little juvenile tarpon back in the water. Gonna go ahead and turn his body. Fish on. I don't know if it's a snook or a tarpon. Little snook. Little guy. Show him off to the camera. Then release him. Little snook on the terrorize. Too small, man. Not worth the picture. We're gonna go ahead and release him. Just casted the terrorize right in that spillway, let it just swim out, and got another dinky snook. Snook, terrorize, there he goes. See you, bud. Alright guys, first one of the day, just ate a little bluegill, probably like a solid 25 plus inch snook, really healthy one, really fat one. First one of the day, like I just said, hopefully we'll catch more, but uh, we're going to go ahead and release this guy and try to get some more snook and tarpon. Get a nice look at her. Ooh, look at that baby. Oh yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Get him over here. There he goes. All right, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, smash the subscribe button, and comment something down below. Also, I know I said this in the beginning of the video, but I'm sorry for not uploading. I've been busy, but hopefully, this video makes it up to y'all. Also, update, update. In a couple months, probably by the end of December, I should have a GNU or a small boat, something like that. Either a GNU, a little skiff, a little John boat, something like that. So the videos are going to get better. Just have to give it some time. But uh, yeah, guys, that's about it. Thank you guys for all the love and positive feedback I get. It really does mean a lot. But uh, I'm going to stop talking and I'll see you guys in the next video.